What's up, guys? This is Bobby Black. I'm here with Sean from Yeti Farms. What's up, Sean? How are you doing, man? Having a great night here at this party. It's great to see all of our colleagues and peers here getting these amazing awards. Everybody's dressed up so beautifully. We're super happy to be here. Thanks for having us. We are so stoked to be here. Did you ever think you'd see a bunch of Wooks and Stoners dressed so damn nice? I did not. We were actually saying the same thing when we got here tonight. All the ladies look so beautiful. All the guys have got tucks and coats on and everything. We're all cleaned up. Nobody's got jeans and t-shirts on tonight, so it's awfully nice to see everybody all dressed up and in good spirits tonight. Cool, cool, man. And so, uh, were you nominated for the stuff tonight? You are, right? I was, yeah. Yeti Farms is a concentrate company out of Pueblo. We're all organic outdoor cultivation company. We do a full plant extraction, and we were nominated tonight in the concentrate category. We unfortunately didn't get it, but again, we're working with a lot of great companies. We're just happy to be nominated and be here tonight to say hi to everybody. No, that's awesome, man. Uh, it's an honor just to be nominated, and, uh, you know, it's, it's sometimes it's some pretty stiff competition. It's extremely stiff competition. Our industry has a lot of top players here in Colorado, as we all know. And with that, we're always kind of chasing each other's IP and trying to keep right at the top of the game. This is honestly all about producing the best product possible for the client, the cleanest, and keeping up with the most technology to keep everybody happy. And we're all trying to chase that same goal right now. And what's your take on the whole uh, hydrocarbon versus CO2 uh, extraction methods? And what, what do you think produces the best tasting and the purest? I mean, what, what's, your, what's your preference? My personal preference and everybody, I mean, we can get into the CO2 hydrocarbon, but we do a hydrocarbon blend of uh, propane and butane. We get everything down to zero parts per million, so I have no concerns whatsoever about hydrocarbons. My personal favorite is nucleated or auto-buttered shatter. It has the beautiful sugar taste to it. It has all the terps and all the flavor that I love. Shatter goes everywhere. It's shatter. For yeah. me, I just like to scoop that sugar up and try it with the full terp effect. See, it's funny because when I first started doing the dab coverage for High Times, I wrote the first few dab stories for High Times, and... That's what I was saying. Everybody was saying that that was wrong, that that was like, your shit's unstable. No, you know, man. it's like, look at it, it's melting, it's morphing. And like, and I was like, yeah, but look at how delicious it is. It's so good. And it, everybody was saying you, you weren't doing it right or you weren't doing it pure. And, and, then, and then live resin came along yeah. and that really cemented it for me. Like when the first time Giddy Up turned me on to live oh, resin, yeah, that's the fire. I was like, this is, the, this is what I want to smoke. Like, I, yeah, the other stuff's nice. It's like but, licking the bud, man. You yeah. literally taste the full profile of the plant. It's, no moist. Radiation. It's moist and yeah. tasty and stinky and yep. oh, it's just delicious. I love the man. oily, wet, gassy yeah. OGs. That's really my personal preference. And uh, there's a lot of stiff competition, like I said, in this industry now. I'm very fortunate to be able to try a lot of the high-end stuff from my other colleagues. We all share amongst each other. And uh, it is. The game just keeps getting better and better by the year. We're very proud to be working in it and be in the small position we are down in Pueblo. Well, uh, uh, congratulations on your nomination. Uh, I hope I'll be rooting for you next year for sure. Uh, and uh, have a great night and a great holiday. We appreciate everything. Thanks so much to everybody for putting this on.